The new F-150 has been spotted testing, indicating the release date is close. The mid-cycle update is imminent, with the current model launched in 2021. Having seen few major changes aside from the beastly Raptor R. As usual, competition in the half-ton truck segment is fierce. Ram and Silverado are redesigned for the 2025 season. Toyota already launched the next-gen Tundra. And the Nissan Titan is also expected as an all-new model with a twin-turbo V6 engine. They're all trying to catch up with Ford, which sells nearly a million F-Series trucks annually. With the upcoming update to its most popular model, Ford could achieve seven-digit sales. The truck has been spotted in Australia. There, the F-150 lineup is limited only to two trim levels, XLT and Lariat, and the model we can see is Platinum. This is the same truck sold in the US produced there and transported to Australia, where it is converted to right-hand drive. The prototype shows an updated front grille and bumper. The current F-150 lineup offers more than 10 distinct grille designs, but Ford might trim some for the 2025 model year. Plus, the lighting elements have been tweaked, especially the taillights, which now feature a more 3D style. Inside, there's a massive 12-inch display, a significant upgrade from the 8-inch touchscreen offered in the Australian F-150, hinting at some serious interior enhancements. Ford is also rolling out the Pro Access tailgate, finally delivering a practical feature to rival GM's Multi-Pro and Multi-Flex and Ram's Multifunction tailgate. The inclusion of Fox dual live valve shock absorbers promises a smoother ride, though it's still unclear which trims will benefit from this advanced suspension system. The truck offers a diverse engine lineup, starting with a 2.7-liter V6, equipped with a twin-turbo system ready to unleash 325 horsepower. You can upgrade the ride with a V8 engine, but it will become more expensive. Expect the same configuration to be $2,000 higher than before, similar to the recent hike for the V8 Mustang. However, you'll be rewarded with a no-lag drivetrain and 400 ponies under the hood. For even more muscle, there's the larger 3.5-liter V6, with configuration starting at 400 horsepower and climbing to 450 ponies for the Raptor Edition. This engine also powers the hybrid variant, delivering a total output of 430 horsepower and 580 pound-feet of torque with electric assistance. The hybrid truck doesn't lag much behind traditional ICE setups in towing capacity. It can haul up to 13,000 pounds, while the 2025 Ford F-150 maxes out at 14,000 pounds. Ford jumped into the Raptor R production right after Ram unleashed their Raptor Killer TRX. Meanwhile, Chevrolet and GM stayed out of the showdown. The Raptor R has already seen a power boost when engineers increased total output to 720 horsepower, outmuscling the Ram TRX, which stays at 702 ponies for 2025. Its 5.2-liter supercharged V8 may be smaller than the Ram's Hellcat, but it's more powerful delivering a beastly 650 pound-feet of torque on an already impressive spec sheet. Expect the Raptor R to hit the market a few months after the standard model. Changes to the 2025 Ford F-150 are pretty minor since the company is currently focused on the electric truck. The F-150 Lightning has finally hit production, and in 2025, the Blue Oval will roll out new configurations to expand the lineup. However, expect production to ramp up late next year as Ford reassesses the electric pickup market. While these EVs can work as hard as their ICE counterparts, the high purchase price and maintenance costs still pose major hurdles to widespread popularity. The current model was a bit off schedule, dropping in December, while Ford typically kicks off production in September and starts delivering the first batches by October or early November if there are hiccups. This time around, the company is going to introduce the F-150 earlier and announce updates for the 2025 model year. Expect no delays this time. The truck should hit dealerships by late October.